This is a demonstration of the Altair 8800 computer. And what we're going to show here today is the Altair booting from disk into um, CPM 2.2. As you can see, the Altair is connected to a VT220 um, terminal from DEC. And the demonstration really is to show um, that it is possible to boot into CPM and the speed that it takes um, to boot from a floppy disk. So I'm going to start by turning on the unit. And before you can actually use an Altair, you need to uh, reset the unit, which I've just done. You can see that the VT220 is running and it's already connected in the back of the unit. In order to boot CPM, we need to point the uh, program counter to um, FF00 hex, um, which is the starting point of the bootloader. And we do that by toggling in um, the at address um, using the toggle switches at the moment that's now set um, for uh, that um, address, FF00. As soon as we've done that, we set the program counter to read the switches by examining that particular memory location by raising this examine switch, which we've done now. And you can see that the address is now set to FF00 along these lights. And um, this row of LEDs is actually showing you um, the particular byte that's sitting in that uh, memory location. So if we start executing the, um, the program, um, by flicking the switch down here, you'll see that um, the program is now booting and that we're in CPM. Um, rather quick, if I just do a directory, um, I'll show you on the screen what that looks like. And if we do the same command again, and we'll have a look at what's happening on the front panel when I do that DIR. And that's it.